What's up logical people? This is Amar. I have an easy and quick mental math problem for you. Fill in the empty squares using the numbers from 1 to 9 so that each row and each column has the right product. All the numbers from 1 to 9 must be used. Your challenge is to solve this problem in your mind. So try to avoid pen and paper and please comment below how much time you took to solve it. Pause the video and think logically. In a column or in a row, these squares represent factors of that specific product. So this product value should be divisible by each of these numbers. The easiest number to start with is the number 5. The reason is that the multiples of 5 has either 0 or 5 in the units place. Out of these products, the numbers divisible by 5 are 120 and 180. So 5 must be present here. The next easier number to target is 7 because it's a higher prime number. So it's quite possible that only a few of the products would be divisible by it. Out of these products, the numbers divisible by 7 are 56 and 21. So 7 must be present here. Now consider this column with product 21. 7 times 3 gives 21. So the number 3 must be present in one of these two squares. And now it's obvious that the other number in this column must be 1. So that 7 times 3 times 1 would give 21. That's why 3 and 1 are the candidates of these two squares. Here if you analyze the center row, the number 1 cannot be present in this square because the remaining two numbers cannot give the product as 120 even if you use the two highest numbers. Now, the number 1 has only this square available. So it goes there. And eventually, the number 3 has to be in the middle square. In the center row, 3 times 5 is 15. 15 times what number gives the product as 120? It's simply the number 8. Now, in the first row, to get the result 54, we can have the combination either 6 and 9 or 9 and 6. But the number 9 cannot be present in the first column as 96 is not divisible by 9. So here it must be 6 and that's why 9 would be in the middle square. Now 6 times 8 is 48. 48 times what number gives 96? It's simply 2. And here we have the remaining number 4. I'm sure you must have come up with your own approach. So I'll be waiting for you in the comments section. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and share the video. And if you are new, please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated with a new logic puzzle every week. Till then give a try to these quick brain teasers. Also check out interview puzzles on my channel, Logically Yours.